Hello, I'm Melly Button, and I'm playing Man of Medan today. And uh, I managed to get Conrad killed, so <laughs> so um, I never said I was going to play it good. <laughs> oh, one of us is definitely going to get stabbed. Come on! My luck will be Alex and not Julia. Stop me. What's the matter, Tree Bone? Don't shut up to me anymore. Uh. Get going. Do any? Is he gone yet? <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't help me. Help yourself. I'm gonna get Alex killed, aren't I? Help me. Oh dear. Come on. <laughs> Oh no, I'm gonna get Alex Cowell. <laughs> oh, oh, Fliss! Oh, thank God. Yeah, it's me. I got Come stabbed. on, let's go. Help me. <laughs> Jesus! We gotta get somewhere safe. Poor Conrad. I, I tried to save it, but... Are we good here? I think... Yeah, I think we'll be alright here. Be fine. We'll never find us here. We've only run about ten meters away. Oh no! It's the man who wants to judge me. Oh, hello. Hi. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Right. I didn't mean to. <laughs> now you're another one, Da. Another one. There was only one to begin with. I've only killed one person. And what about Conrad? He, or rather you, <sighs> should have been a bit less careless. I swear I did the bloody breathing thing properly. Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? Uh, you will, I, think I've I hope. Kind of figured what's Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. I think that's just making Quite us hallucinate. A lot of well then, how can I put this? There may be forces at play here that are more scientific and even some that are more political, you know? Less supernatural. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. He's a magician too. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go on, back to it. Speak soon. Wait, where's Conrad? Has anyone seen him? We got split Dead. up. I, I saw him. Dead. I, I, I mean, Fliss and I both did, uh, right? Did. <clears throat> I didn't see anything. Is that the truth? Because you better hope it is. Oh, shut up, Julia. Okay. What the hell was wrong with you back there? What? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on. No, no come on. That's ridiculous. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? 
the stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Did you see the gold? Anything? Manchurian yes. gold isn't actually gold. It's a fucking chemical and it's leaking all over cargo hold too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this isn't exactly what our friendly fishermen are expecting either. This should go over well. Where are the crew? What do you mean they're dead? What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big floating coffin. So where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. The ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... Mate, it's 70 that's years great, old. but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. Oh my Alex, no. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. Do one of these? Oh no, it's full Great. of holes. Could use these if they weren't Swiss cheese. Hmm. Find a way up. Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. We just got here. <laughs> what do you expect? Oh, damn. Okay, I wasn't actually expecting a dead person. Help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. I'll pull you up. Get up here way before me. This is. I swear you were behind me. This is where I chased Conrad before. You chased him. I don't remember you chasing him. Over here. Got a way through here. Where 
does everyone go? Howdy. No? Is this where Conrad was? Find a radio yet? No, but there's gotta be a radio on this ship. There there has to be. I'm not exactly confident about our chances of survival at this point. <laughs> That's a cherry thing to say. <laughs> Let me look at it. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? Hello, Mr. Dead Man. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees 30 minutes south, 151 degrees 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. Hello, hello, is anyone out there? Please come in. Oh no. Hey, come here, look. What the oh no, is this where Brad was? Oh my God. What's up, Brad? This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. I got, I got this. I'm not losing you to this fucking ship. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Oh, Julie, no. Off. You're not my bodyguard. I can take care of myself. You can be my bodyguard Hello. there. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. All right. Why do you need Julia? Normally large. <laughs> oh no! Did we die? Julia stabbed earlier. Is that all it was? Is the bloody graze on the leg? Broken bones. Everything still work? Unfortunately. You gonna go right down there? I'm okay. You see anything? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. O okay. We'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. Uh, 
after you. Go. Looks like we're in the lower levels of the ship. Hmm. This is where those guys were at the start. Oh. Hello. Uh. Not to speed in here. Take a look. Look down there. I think that's the engine room. Good place to find a generator, right? Let's find out. Mm, maybe. Shit. No more ladder. Jump. Jump. I can drop the rest of the way. Big jump. Wait. Whoop. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, be knees. Yeah. Fine. Come on down. What's up? Uh, oh, you didn't fucking see that. Ray, no. Of course you didn't. Um, I did. <laughs> hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seeing clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. So, the ship was carrying Manchurian gold. But that turned out not to be gold at all. It's a toxic chemical. And there's this weird fog everywhere, right? Well, maybe that's Manchurian gold. And maybe we're breathing it in and it's fucking us right the hell up. I sure as shit saw some stuff I cannot believe. And maybe I was right not to believe it. I was hallucinating. I guess it makes sense, though. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. Yeah. They're all seeing this crazy shit going down, and they all thought it was real. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I don't know. It seems like the plane came in contact with the ship, but it's just a theory. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. All right. Well, that's kind of what I thought anyway, but um, I'm going to leave it there then. So uh, if you enjoyed, then stay tuned for the next one. And thank you for watching, and goodbye!